Yo, what's good, what's good, what's good? It's your boy, Poetic Lamar, and I'm back with another reaction. <coughs> man, look, as you can see, guys, I am still a little under weather for some odd reason, man. Been this way for like two weeks now. Still trying to bounce back, so please forgive me if I sound a little congested, right? With all that being said, you guys know the motto, slow grind better than no grind and just take time. And one thing about it, we're going to stay on business all the time. Yes, Lord. Hey, Kendrick Lamar dropped the diss track. Yeah, I just said it. You heard it right. He dropped. He finally dropped. Not no feature, just him. And dog, man, internet been going crazy. Yeah. Hey, bro. I wanted to make sure that I uh, I reacted to this, you know what I'm saying? So I tried my best not to listen to the song, and I had. So my reactions is gonna be with you guys. You know, we, you know, I I tried, I did my best. Woo! It was hard, but I made it. With all that being said, man, the name of the track is Euphoria, uh, uh, a feeling of well-being or elation. This alone, the title is a slight, you know, you know, shade and Drake, you know, Drake had the the show with uh, what's 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 your face? The girl name, you hear me? The day I think that that's what that is. You hear me? Uh, on HBO called Euphoria. You hear me? So I think I think they end up getting canceled. If I'm not mistaken, you know you know correct me if I'm wrong. You know I'm human. I make mistakes. You hear me? You know I could be wrong. You know, but if I'm not, then I'm not. And if I am, oh well, I don't give a fuck. <laughs> it's life. It happens. You hear me? Anyway, man, thank you guys so much for tuning into the channel. If you're new here, make sure that you like, comment, and subscribe. I really done said enough, so let me shut the fuck up and let's get to the reaction. But you know, we gotta, you know, do the one, you know, let's go. Yeah, you know, we had to do that. You know, one time for the one time, big step alone, nothing. <laughs> let's go, man. I'm excited, bro. I'm excited. All right, let's go. She heard me. Woo, she my man, see if you back. Euphoria. Whoa. Them superpowers get neutralized, I can only watch in silence The famous actor we once knew is looking paranoid and now spiraling Bruh, I love, I love when Kendrick come on tracks like this This remind me of like the older Kendrick, the Pippa Butterfly Kendrick That was my favorite Kendrick, you know And um, as I, when I think I'm reacting to like the, uh, the Drake disc when I say that like uh, album of the Big Steppers, I believe. You're, you know, Mr. Morale, whatever his last album was. I still haven't listened to it yet, bro. Just because sonically, I literally could like, I just really couldn't get into like the first couple of songs, you know, that you know, that was on the project. You know, everybody's telling me it's a great project. Um, you know, once you really get to listen to it, like, like, you know, but at the same time, like, it's like, it's like. It's wine, you know what I'm saying? It's like fine wine, you hear me? So eventually I might have to, you know, just sit down and just, you know, get in that zone and listen to it. But, you know, I like this type of, you know, I love this type of, I love this type of kitchen off, off rip, you hear me? Watching silence, the famous actor we once knew is looking paranoid and now spiraling. You're moving just like a degenerate, heavy antique is feeling distasteful. Why calculate you're not as calculated? I can even predict your angle. Fabricating stories on the family front, cause you heard Mr. Morale. A pathetic master manipulator, I can smell the tales on you now. You're not a rap artist, you're a scam artist with the hopes of being accepted. Tommy Hill figure stood out, but Fubu never had been your collection. I make music that Electrify em. You make music that pacify em. I can double down on that line, but spare you this time. That's random acts of kindness. No, you. Ooh, you gotta understand the way he's talking to him. He talking to him like it's such a calm voice. Like, look, man. I'm not even. I'm not even mad at you. You heard me? I'm on a whole other level. My energy is beyond that. Spiritually, I'm beyond that. You feel me? That's pretty much what he's saying. Like, I'm on a whole nother level to you, bro. What I'm in my life is complete. Is only what you could dream to be in your life. You know what I'm saying? And one thing, the difference between me and you, one of the main differences is that I feed people spiritually. You feel me? We connect, we connect on another, on a higher level of existence. Right, my music connects with a higher level of existence, right? 
your music is, is all about vibes. It's all about, you know, um, having a good time, right? My music, it transcends all of that. My music is real. My, my music is, is life, you know? When people sit back, they're not just sitting back to try to, because they want to try to feel good or get a high. My music is like, okay, damn, I connect with this. This resonates with me, right? And like, your music going to do that because you, you're just full of lies. You're, you're pretending to be somebody that you're not. Ooh. He really talking to him in, in the state of like, you my son for real. But you, 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 you got a long way to go. You hear me? You hear me? Oh, oh, all that type of time though. Oh, y'all know I got the Cranberry Juice and the Mason Jar. Y'all, hey, it's one of them nights. Nice. Yeah, we so fine. I can double down on that line, but spare you this time. That's random acts of kindness. Know you're a master manipulator and a habitual liar too. But don't tell no lie about me, and I won't tell truths about you. Shoo. Okay. Shoo. Let's switch. Shoo. Shoo. Yeah, I'm out the way, yeah, I'm low, okay, yeah, the island right here is remote, okay, I ain't thinking about no reaper, nigga, I'm reaping what I sow, okay, got a Benjamin and a Jackson all in my house, like I'm Joe, okay, hell cat, made his own boys in them types LA solo, okay, everybody wanna be demon, till they get chipped by your throwaway, and I might do a show a day, what's a lame, always a lame, oh, you thought the money, the power of fame will make you go away, have you ever played, have you ever, okay, nigga, let's play, have you ever, watch your enemy down, like with a poker face, have you ever paid 500 thou like to an open case? Well, I have, and I failed at both, but I came out straight. Oh, that boy said, Let's play. Have you ever? And like, like, he's like, like, like I'm about to say, Hey, have you ever, you know, did real shit? That really what he said. Like, have you ever paid 500, you know, to you know, to a lawyer? Have you ever, you know, for an open case? Have you ever, you know, you know, look down on somebody with an open, you know, with, with a, you know, yeah. I don't know what he said. Some type of face. You, you, you know, you get it, you know. He stood over somebody with that face, you know. Can't you, you, you say that you killed somebody? That what you say, can't you? You know, my voice is going to get like this. Because what, nigga? You say what, nigga? Okay. Boy, I'm getting a hold on the side of Kendrick. I didn't even know it existed. My God. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> Oh my god. It's trying to come out, y'all. Oh man, let's get back to it, bro. Woo. Have you ever watch your enemy down like with a poker face? Have you ever paid 500 thou like to an open case? Well, I have, and I failed at both, but I came out straight. I hate when I rap or talk about guns, then somebody die, they turn into nuns, then I hop online like pray for my city. He faking for likes and digital hugs. His daddy a killer, he wanna be junior, they must have forgot the shit that they done. Dementia must run in his family, but let it get shaky. I park your son. The very first time I shot me a Drake, the homie had told me to aim it this way. I didn't point down enough. Today I show you I learned from those. Mistakes. Somebody had told me that you got a ring on oh God, I'm ready to double the wage I'd rather do that than let a Canadian nigga make Pac turn in his grave Cut the finish, you got shit twisted What is it? Bro, he even addressed, he addressed it every day The, the shit Drake had did with Pac talk about, you know, like, nigga I'ma sit on business, you ain't got Pac ain't gonna turn in his grave nigga. I'm gonna represent, you hear me? I'm gonna represent, fuck what you talking about, nigga Canadian nigga make Pac turn in his grave Cut the finish, you got shit twisted What is it, the brakes? I hurt your feelings, you don't work with me no more Okay, it's three ghosts left And I see two of them kissing and hugging on stage I love them to death And then eight bars, I'll explain their phrase Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on Make sure we, 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 we listen properly, you heard me Finish, you don't work with me no more, okay It's three ghosts left and I see two of them kissing and hugging on stage I love them to death and then eight bars I'll explain their phrase It's not nobody can tell me, I don't wanna talk on no celly You know I got language barriers, it's no accent you can sell me Your Cole and Ivory know I'm a selfish nigga, the crown is heavy I pray they- Bro, Cole apologize, why you talking about Cole, bro? He apologized, 
He said he was sorry. He said he was sorry. He was going to my nigga call, man. Jermaine call. Fuck, what's wrong with you, Kendrick? Come on, man. He said he was sorry. You can't do that. Take it back. Take it back. Tell me, I don't wanna talk on no celly. You know I got language barriers. It's no accent you can sell me. Your cold and Ivory know I'm a selfish nigga. The crown is heavy. I pray they my real friends. If not, I'm YNW Melly. I don't like you poppy shit. Bro, he said, I pray they my real friends. If not, I'm YNW Melly. That boy is not beating that case. He is not coming on. Bro, when this nigga put in a up song, like, that's gonna be world, like, where I know that this nigga killed his friends. This shit is crazy. This does not help your old boy case at all, bro. At all. Like, your honor. Your honor. Even this nigga on the West Coast that don't even know this nigga, know this nigga killed his friends. Come on, your honor. Let's do the right thing. Get this nigga off the streets. Because, my God. Oh. That ain't help YW Bell. I'm going to keep it. I, I kind of wish you would have left that, you know, that line out. But that was a bar now. That was a bar now. You yeah. I pray they my real friends. If not, I'm YNW Melly. I don't like you popping shit at Pharrell. For him, I inherit the beef. Yeah, fuck all that pushing P. Let me see you push a T. You better off spinning again on him. You think about pushing me. Hey, he say before you talk about, you know, talk shit to me. Hey, what happened to that last nigga you call yourself dissing? You know, you talking all that shit. You know, before you pushing me, you might as well push it, push a T. You heard me? Because he, he still got you laid in a, you know, body bag. Yes, Lord. With your feet up in the air. He put your feet in the air, Drake. He put your feet in the air. Both of them. You heard me? Your legs in the air. Yeah, both ways. Yeah. <laughs> not me saying both ways. Hey, if you get it, you get it. You heard me? We not watching either one. We not watching either one. Let me see you push a T. You better off spinning again on him. You think about pushing me. He's Terrence Thor and I'm Terrence Crawford. Yeah, I'm whooping feet. We ain't gotta get personal. This a friendly fade. You should keep it that way. I know some shit about niggas that make gonna wanna look like a saint. This ain't been about critics, not about gimmicks, not about who the greatest is. Always been about love and hate. Now let me say I'm the biggest hater. I hate the way that you walk, the way that you talk. I hate the way that you dress. I hate the way that you sneak this. If I catch flight, it's gonna be direct. We hate the bitches you fuck. Cause they confuse themselves with real women. Then notice I said we. It's not just me. I'm what the culture feeling. How many more fairy tale stories about your life till we have? enough how many more black features till you finally feel that you're black enough i like drake with the melodies i don't like drake when he act tough you gonna make a nigga bring back puff let me see if chubs really crash something yeah, i ain't even lying i'm with him on that i, I really do like the melody drake you hear me teenage fever oh turn that into something hey nobody they hey it hit different when he on that yeah i fuck with it I ain't gonna lie, I fuck with Drake. I ain't gonna lie. But I, I am not the fan when he be all that, you know, rapper tough. You know what I mean? I know you from the grassy Drake. I'm not saying you can't be, you know, one of them, but I know you from the grassy Drake. We're Chad Jimmy Drake. I used to watch you grow up. Come, come on, Drake. Like Drake when he act tough, you gon' make a nigga bring back puff. Let me see if Chubbs really crash something. Yeah, my first one, like my last one. This a classic, you don't have one. Let your core audience stomach that. Didn't tell them where you get your abs from. V12, it's a fast one. Bow, bow, bow. Last one. Headshot for the year. You better walk around like Daft Punk. Remember? A hey, top dog, who the fuck they think they playing with? Extortion my middle name as soon as you jump off of that plane, bitch. I'm allergic to the lame shit. Only you like being famous. Yaddy can't give you no swag neither. I don't give a fuck about who you hanging with. I hate the way that you walk, the way that you talk. I hate the way that you dress. Surprise, you wanted that feature request. You know that we got some shit to address. I even hate when you say the word nigga. But that's just me, I guess. Some shit just cringeworthy. You ain't even gotta be deep, I guess. Still love when you see success. Everything with me is blessed. Keep making me dance, wave with my hand, and there won't be no threat. I'm knowing they call you the boy, but where's a man? Cause I ain't seen him yet. Matter of fact, I ain't even bleed him yet. Can I bleed him? Back? When I see you stand by six. Oh my god, bro. 
Ain't no nigga, ain't no way you just call this nigga, uh, you know, the boy, a hey boy. You know what I'm saying? He meant this shit as disrespectfully as possible. He said, I know he called you the boy, but I ain't seen no man yet. Ooh, I ain't bleed him yet. Ooh. He, he got more for you. Hold up, sit your ass down. You about to get the rest of this ass whooping. You heard me? Hey, that's crazy, though. That's very disrespectful. That's like a white man calling you boy. That's really what he's telling them. You hear me? In the most disrespectful way possible. <laughs> For real. I ain't seen him yet Matter of fact, I ain't even bleed him yet Can I bleed him? Bad. When I see you stand by sexy red I believe you see two bad bitches I believe you don't like women It's real competition You might pop ass with them Let's speak on percentage Show me your splits I'll make sure I double back with you You assigned to a nigga that signed to a nigga That said he was signed to that nigga Try cease and assist on a like that record Oh what, you ain't like that record? Back to back, I like that record I'ma get back to that for the record Why would I call around trying to get hurt on niggas? Y'all thinking my life is rap? That's whole shit, I got a son to raise But I can See, you don't know nothing about that. Waking them up, know nothing about that. Then tell them to pray, know nothing about that. Then giving them tools to walk through life like day by day, know nothing about that. Teaching them morals, integrity, discipline. Listen, man, you don't know nothing about that. Bro, ain't no way this nigga telling them Drake, he don't know how to be a good father. <clears throat> ain't no way. He really up here telling them, hey, look, I'm a real man, I'm a real father. You heard me? You don't know nothing about that. Ooh, ooh, ooh. To me, that's the most disrespectful shit that you can tell another man. Nigga, fuck everything you talking about, nigga. You don't know how to be a good father. Because you don't know what a man look like. Ooh, ooh, ooh. You don't know nothing about that. Hey, hey, that, that hurt a nigga's soul. You heard me? How another man going to tell you you don't know how to be a good father? You got another man tip me. Hey, hey, Drake, you got to, hey, hey, it's on site. Fuck all the other shit. It's on site, Drake. It got to be on site. He telling you, Aubrey, that you don't know how to raise your, that you don't know how to raise, a, be a good daddy, be a daddy. Man, you know how disrespectful that is? He say, he say, Look, you're not bigger than that, but like, I'm going to just tell I'm going to give you the guideline, you know, in ways that you can be a good father. Because you don't know how to do that. So, you know, you ain't never seen that before. You don't know how to do that. Let me tell you what, you know, what goes into being a good father. And he saw a list of ways, you know, how he a good father and what makes a good man and what makes a good father. Come on, man. Hey, because you can't be a good, you, hey, you can't be a good man if you ain't a good father. Come on, now. Let me say it again. I say, you can't be a good man if you're not a good father. Because if you're an ancient father, you can't be a good man. Come on, man. What? This is crazy. Oh, my God. I think of my life is rap. That's whole shit. I got a son to raise, but I can see you don't know nothing about that. Waking them up, know nothing about that. Then tell them to pray, know nothing about that. Then giving them tools to walk through life like day by day, know nothing about that. Teaching them morals, integrity, discipline. Listen, man, you don't know nothing about that. Speaking the truth and consider what God's considering, you don't know nothing about that. Ain't 20 v one, it's one v twenty. If I gotta smack niggas, that right with you. Yeah, bring them out too. I clean them out too. Tell Bean that he better stay right with you. Am I battling ghosts or AI? Nigga feeling like Joe Hill Austin. Funny he was in a film called AI. And my sixth sense telling me to off him I'm a brick niggas all in the coffin Yeah, OB ho niggas is dick riders Tell them run to America to imitate heritage They can't imitate this violence What I learned is niggas don't like the West Coast And I'm fine with it, I'll push the line with it Pick a nigga off one at a time with it We can be on a three hour time difference Don't speak on the family, Crody It can get deep in the family, Crody Talk about me and my family, Crody Someone go bleed in your family, Crody I be at New Hall King eating fried rice with a dip sauce and a blammy, Crody Tell me your cheese and farm We can do this right now on the camera, Crody Hey, fuck Y'all niggas, I don't trust y'all niggas. I weigh one finger and thump y'all niggas like, mm, feel go punk y'all niggas. They punk y'all niggas. Nobody never took my food. Whoever that's fucking with them, fuck you niggas and fuck the industry too. If you take it there, I'm taking it further. Psst, that's something you don't wanna do. Is that his way of saying fuck, fuck J. Cole? He said, J. Cole, you can't be on both sides, bro. You gotta choose a side. Whose side you on, J. Cole? Ooh, say, hey, you and the boy just went on tour. Honestly, I believe 
I believe J. Cole should be on Drake's side. I don't know what his relationship is like with Kendrick. You know what I'm saying? But I just feel like J. Cole and Drake is closer. So if he had to choose, he should choose, you know, Drake. I just, you know, my standpoint, I just feel like they're closer. They got a better relationship, better rapport. So I just have to be on tour, you know, with each other. If you even so. I don't know. That's my standpoint. What you guys think? You hear me? Comment down below. We don't wanna hear you say nigga no more We don't wanna hear you say nigga no more Stop Whoa Yo, uh That was a lot, bro I'm not even gonna hold you That was a lot That was a lot Uh <laughs> Yeah, it was it was it wasn't even like real disrespectful, disrespectful until you got to call to tell that nigga, you know, you not a, you not a, you not a, you not only is you not a man, you feel me, but you don't know how to be a good father. That hurts. That hurts. I feel that for Drake. You feel me? I felt that for Drake. You feel me? Come on, man. Hey, that's tough. Hey, man. Thank you guys so much for tuning into the channel. Make sure that you like, comment, and subscribe. You know we all are going off of here, man. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Make sure that you guys have the notification bell to be notified for whenever I release new content. Yes, Lord. With all that being said, man, you guys know how we do this. Stay humble, stay blessed, stay safe. Most importantly, wait, I'm going to let you say it. You heard me? Go ahead and say it. You got the privilege. Come on. Go ahead and say it. Uh, <laughs> you know what it is? Say your bitch ass out the way, huh? <laughs>